Hi guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing fantastic. So today I am doing something a little bit different. This video has been going around for like a couple of weeks, not weeks, a couple of a while. Let's just say a while actually. So um, it's I tried following someone's makeup. So basically, a couple of people have started it. I can't really say per se who started it, but I know it's been going on. Like I've seen. Um, um, Mr. Padre did following Jackie Aina, Anna did it, um, ja um, Jenny Jenkins did it, Thomas Albert has done it. So basically so many people have done it. So I just thought it would be really, really fun to actually give it a go, you know, because um, I'm the kind of person that I don't really do like contour or um, conceal and all that. So this is going to be really interesting to watch or for me to actually do. So today I'm actually following James Charles and he's doing a drugstore back to school look kind of thing so affordable. So um, I think I have most of the stuff he, he used. Who knows? We'll see. So yeah, I can't wait to actually get started. I'm really nervous. I'm actually really excited at the same time. So we'll see how it goes. Okay. Um, yeah, wish me luck. Um, be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already done so. Okay. And yeah, let me get started. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so it's gonna start now. <laughs> So I already went ahead and prepped my skin and my showering, of course, in the morning. Don't want to be stinky for school. And then I prime my face using my favorite moisturizer. I already primed his face with his moisturizer, so um. Well, I washed my face a while ago too, actually, and I did. Because it's actually late right now, and I did put moisturizer on my face as well, so we're just gonna go with that. Because. So I guess since it's not using any primer, I'm not gonna use anything. Foundation and I'm gonna mix the shade 725 and 745. Okay. okay. So, so the CoverGirl Elixir Foundation, we've got it. Got it. And I've got the color 765. Hopefully this goes well. So it looks like he's using his beauty blender. I don't know if it damped his beauty blender or not. So I'm just gonna bounce this into my skin using my damp beauty blender. Ah, damp beauty blender. <laughs> so I'm gonna use my MAC. Blender. It probably wet it, but I don't have water here, so I'm just gonna wet it with my Mac Fix Plus, and then. Uh -oh. Where's my mirror? I don't even have my mirror. Okay. Well, this looks light actually. We definitely don't need to be rocking a full coverage HD foundation stick to high school. It's really not that serious. We don't have anybody to impress, so don't worry about it. To yeah. conceal my face today, I'm using the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. Okay, slow down, dude. Um, um, I'm gonna put all my foundations on my face and then we'll go to concealer. I normally don't use Beauty Blender for my foundation, so this is definitely weird. And yeah, it didn't do its brow, and I normally do my brows first, so. <laughs> This is totally weird too. Oh my gosh. Uh, I don't think this is damp enough. This already feels messy. Okay, so he definitely applied it all over his face. Oh, uh, let's hope I don't look like a ghost at the end of this. Feels really weird. This foundation might not be my shade, but we'll go for it. We'll see. Cause it looks a bit um, it looks different on camera, and it looks different here. Okay, all right. Five minutes later, we're done with the face. Yeah. Okay, so it's concealing. He's using the Maybelline Fit Me concealer. So I've also got that here in the shade 30 Cafe. <laughs> and it looks like he's put it under his eye and on his forehead. Oh gosh, this is interesting. Have we done this before? <laughs> okay, all right. So I'll just do what he did. This 
it's really quick for sure. So you did that and then I'm way out of my comfort zone here. Focus on it. It's Okay, blemishes. I don't really have any blemishes, but I have a pimple right there, so I'll put it there. Okay, so he's using his damn beauty blender again to blend it in. Oh my gosh, it's so fast. Stop! Okay, so I'm gonna. <laughs> this is terrible. <laughs> Alright, so it's blended it in already, and I'm going to take my damp beauty blender again and blend this concealer in. I'm already tired. Okay, let's go. It looks like it just, well, blended it in. Wow, there's a face for everything. I can't believe I'm actually like concealing on camera right now. Never done this on camera before. And every time I do it, I always end up blending it in. Like it looks like I'm, I didn't conceal at all because I just blend it in and because I, I feel like I have wet too much makeup on my face. Or maybe I'm just not doing it right. I don't know. This, this feels weird. <laughs> oh shit. I definitely look light. I feel like I look like a ghost right now. <laughs> I, I don't know. I look funny. Oh gosh. Breakout. So if you do get one, never fear. Don't worry. Just grab your favorite concealer and just put it over your pimple. So it's basically just talking about putting it over your breakouts. I don't really have any breakouts, so I'm not really gonna do that. Yeah. Out those edges. By doing this, we're keeping the concealer exactly where we want it to be, right over the pimple, obviously, so it's hidden. And then just well, I should put it over my pimple, actually. That one. So it's used a fluffy, fluffy, fluffy. Fluffy brush <laughs> to like blend it in. Alright. Okay, set my face in place today. I'm gonna be using the Cody or some powder. You guys know I definitely have a very, very interesting history with this one, but. Okay, so I do not have that Cody powder. Yeah. No, I do not have that. So. I have with me here the e.l.f. which is affordable but it's really ashy, like ashy. And then I've got the Demi Blend so I'm going to use that because that goes well. So we'll see what it's gonna, where it's going to put it. I'm just going to grab a little bit of powder really lightly on my R13 brush from Morphe and just set my under eyes in place. So it's using the powder just to set the concealers in place and she's using a brush so I'm just gonna get a a brush as well uh as you said it already oh uh, so you use two brushes to s okay so anyway I am going to Oh Lord, set it. Am I doing anything? <laughs> it just feels. Is this doing anything? Oh God. I don't like the way my face looks right now. This is why I don't conceal, <laughs> to be honest. Okay, so Morphe is obviously not a drugstore brand that is sold in like CVS or Walgreens or anything, but their products are super, super cheap. Okay, so he's basically using the powder to set all over his face. So I'm going to do that too. 
Right, actually, no. Yeah. First, I'm do that. Okay. So it's going all over his face. <coughs> Setting that. Set his neck. I have that. <laughs> it's funny, I actually just got this as a gift, so that's good. <laughs> I have that. Alright. I'm a 509 brush, and I'm going to dip into the shade right up in here, and I'm just going to lightly bronze it my face because. Okay, so it's going to bronze it on his face. I don't bronze either, but we're bronzing. Your girl's bronzing this face, and we're bronzing together. Uh, I forgot which color it took. <laughs> Dip into the shade right up in here, and I'm just going to. So this shade right up there. So it looks like it's that shade. It doesn't even have a name. Well, it used to. So I'm using the exact shade then. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I'm excited. Should put it right there. It's not doing anything. Hmm. Right, it's doing something. It's just because I'm darker. Yeah. Ooh. I see it. I see it. Ooh. Bronze it. All right, so he's really going in there. So he's going on his forehead as well. <laughs> Why is my face like this? The contour, and I'm gonna dip into the Elf blush palette, and I'm gonna. Oh, so you already went on both sides. You didn't show me that. He only showed one side, and I did one side. I think that's it. This shade right up in this corner right here. So it's going, he's using the e.l.f. blush palette, and he's using that shade in the corner right there. <laughs> Let's hope it's the same thing. Is it the same thing? No, it's not. We don't have the same palette. I can't tell if we actually have the same shade or not. I don't think we do. So, no, we don't, but it's using that shade right there. That looks like a plumish color. So, I'm gonna go for that shade right there as well. Yeah. Okay, so we don't look dead. Let's add some color. Alright, so it looks like it's just applying it where you normally put blush. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> no, that's wrong. Actually, it's not bad. Ooh, it's not bad. Okay. I'm guessing obviously he's going to put it on the same side. <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> <laughs> he just said. So next we're going to really quickly play the Wait. Wait. Oh, need a breather. Okay. Okay, this is actually going so. This I can't talk anymore. This is actually going well so far, to be honest. It's not a disaster yet. 
Okay, and for this I'm actually going to be using a not drugstore product. And I'm going to be using the benefit for sensor relevance of the shade number three, but I can't use this for a very, very good reason. Okay, so he's using the he's going to do his brow now. He's using the benefit brow promado pencil. I don't have that, but I have. The Revolution Brow Pencil, so I will be using that in the shade Medium Brown, so Looks like he's just filling in his brow. This would take me forever. He's got bushy brows, like really nice brows, and I don't oh, My brows are always so terrible Okay, so this is gonna take us forever Look at that, that to that I always find it weird when I like do my brows like after the face and everything i prefer to like do it first so it looks like it's just filling in the brows so i'm gonna fill it in yeah so it's filling in the brows so i'm gonna do the same Well, this is not me filling it in exactly, is it? Okay, this is not looking bad. Alright, let's try the other one. Let me just see what he's doing. Cosmetics. One of my favorite brands in the entire world to work on a very, very new and exciting product that I am literally so pumped. Okay, he's talking about his new product. Alright. Oh no, it does not match. I really hope I really hope it cleans his brows because this needs saving. No, he didn't clean it. Alright, so um he didn't clean his brows, but I'm gonna go and put concealer on my brow and just conceal it because it's looking really not so good right now so I'm going to quickly do that I'm using the um, Ellie Girl Pro Concealer in the color fawn I'm just going to use it to make it look decent if you know what I mean And I'm just gonna clean this concealer up. I saved my brows. All right, let's see what I did next. I'm really tired. <laughs> I'm going to the Wet n Wild liquid liner though, and just do a quick little line. I'm keeping this okay. liner. Wet n Wild, Wet n Wild liner, and it's gonna do a quick line. I am terrible with eyeliners. I can't remember the last time I did that. So I don't have the Wet n Wild one. So I have the Zoeva liner. So I'm gonna do a quick line. Sorry, I wasn't looking at the camera. <laughs> and hugging the lash line very, very tightly. I'm not gonna be doing a dramatic wing today and I'm also not gonna be wearing falsies. This is just gonna help add a little bit more volume to the lashes when it comes to adding mascara. Just a super, super simple. Oh gosh, okay. This is where I don't have a steady end. This is what the liner looks like. So I think that should help me. Alright, here we go. Okay. Alright. Uh. <laughs> I can't.
Stop. This is so frustrating. I can't even do it. So soft. Okay, so I don't think I did it like easy this, but something. This is actually my first time using this liner since I bought it, to be honest. I'm done. Can you even see it? That 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 wasn't too bad. I mean, <laughs> I couldn't do it, but I think I managed to get something. It's not straight, obviously, like it is, but. If you lied, if you want to be brave and do a wing, be my guest girl. So I'm not doing, doing a wing. wing. I suck at wings. Like, I can't even remember the last time I did a wing. Uh uh. Get ready to cut those bitches from the other end of the biology room that follow you in fourth period. We've all been there. <laughs> We're definitely not gonna be messing with falsies today. Nobody has time for glue and lashes. Okay. For glue and lashes. Okay, yay. No falsies. Oh, my dream. <laughs> Cause, uh, I, I don't know. There's something about falsies, like, doesn't, I don't have time for that. It's just really annoying sometimes, to be honest. That's why I think I'd rather just have, like, extensions put in without like having to glue lashes on all the time if you know what i mean like the pain uh-uh morning not me i'll tell you that right now so i'm going to be focusing a little bit more on my lashes and to prep them for last care i'm just going to curl them quickly um so i'm not going to curl my lashes because one i don't have one two i never cut i've never curled my lashes before and three yeah it's just there's really nothing to curl, so <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> but I think it's gonna use mascara at some point. For mascara today, I'm gonna be using the new L'Oreal Voluminous Lash Paradise. Can... Okay, so I do not have the L'Oreal Voluminous Paradise mascara, but I have the Mia Door mascara, so I'm going to be using that. No, I am a ride or die for the benefit roller lash, but that $31 is another textbook, so we're gonna have to go to drugstores today. Oh my god, I. Alright, so. I actually really like how this mascara applies. Okay. Okay. Let's go with it. Alright. I love how this mascara applies as well. <laughs> come out, lashes, come out. I was saying before the camera died on me that I sure hope he doesn't do his bottom lash because I've got nothing. <laughs> for highlighter today, I'm gonna use the. I did do his bottom lash. Let's go for it anyway. <laughs> yeah. It's non-existent, but we'll just try. Okay, that would do. <laughs> All right, what next? White and Wild Mega Glow in the shade Golden Flower Crown. So I'll be using the Revolution Strobe Highlighter because I don't have the Wet and Wild one. So let's go for it. Let's see where it's put in it. Out of this entire makeup routine, I feel like highlighter is by the... Okay, so it looks like it popped it here, here, and on his nose, because it's shiny a bit, so, because it didn't really show it. So, we'll go to... I honestly love highlighting. Oh, I love it. I just love when you're, like, blingy. Ooh, ooh, look at that. Right, so you popped it here as well. That might be too much. Might be too much, Liz. Yeah, definitely too much. Okay, 
I think it popped it on his nose as well because it's shiny. So I'm just gonna use the brush because I'm too lazy to use my fingers. And just that's too much. All right. Oh, it popped it on his cupid's bow as well. Why didn't you say anything, Charles? Okay. He didn't say it, he just showed it. Like, later. Like, and it looks like it's on. Okay, I think we're glowing everywhere. Yeah. Full glazed donut walking through the halls. But also, when your teacher comes up to you and is like, um, do you have last night's homework? And you know damn well you were up until 4 a.m. watching makeup tutorials, you can be like, bam! All right. And she'll be so shook and blinded that she won't even remember her question. <laughs> Never underestimate the power of a good glow, sisters. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, man. And then last but not least for the lippity doo dahs today, I'm going to go into the soft matte lip cream from NYX in the shade London. So I have the NYX soft matte cream in the shade Zurich. So it used London. So we'll go for what we have. We actually got to the end. I got to the end. <laughs> These two wears them every single day, all day long, and I love them as well. So definitely a very, very easy lipstick to carry on the go. Just go, just go. So I'm going to apply it as well. Ooh. That is... Yeah, I forgot this is what the color looks like. Hmm. Oh, uh, last time I used this, I had to ombre it. Alright, so that is it. That's on. Ooh. It's definitely too pinky. But I like it. Alright. Let's see if we did anything else. Finally, finally not least to set our face in place through our eight hours of hell. <coughs> Sorry, again, I mean <laughs> school. I'm gonna grab my Morphe prep and set setting spray and I'm just gonna spread my entire face. Alright, so setting his face with a Morphe prep and something spray. I have the MAC fix plugs. MAC Prep and Prime, so we're gonna set our face with that. <laughs> Alright. Well, it sprayed it all over, so. <laughs> Alright. Alright, guys, so this is the super easy and quick back to school glam makeup tutorial all completed. Let's go and actually stop the timer, and we are at 12 minutes and 52 seconds. Oh, not bad at all. That is it! I did it! I made it to the end! That's actually the makeup! It wasn't too bad actually! Oh my gosh! Yeah! Um, my face actually looks different in this mirror than the way- It looks different on the camera and it looks different in real life. I don't know if you understand what I mean. Ugh. I follow the James Charles makeup. This is definitely fun actually. Actually, it wasn't too bad. I'm actually glad there was no eyeshadow because I feel like eyeshadows are like my weakest point as well. So um, yeah, I actually enjoyed filming this. I love him. The way he talks is actually funny. He talks really fast as well. But then honestly, one thing that, that pisses me off is when you're watching a makeup tutorial and they don't they didn't show you that where they put a specific thing and then later you see it that they've done it like when it was spraying the highlight you know obviously i put my highlight there as well but i'm obviously following him but i didn't he didn't show him doing that so that pisses me off when i see people do that and they don't really show like in full details but overall i definitely enjoyed doing this it was so it was funny it was fun um, i'm glad i didn't mess it up my face doesn't look too bad either so that's good as well so yeah i enjoyed this if you enjoyed it give it a thumbs up and yeah let me know what i did in the comment section down below um yeah that will be it basically thank you so much for watching this video and i hope i'll see you in my next video be sure to subscribe on your way out and give it a thumbs up and i'll see you next time bye guys <laughs>